On tape, DiCarlo boasted that Lansky had reopened his connections to Nevada gambling, was heavily involved in skimming profits from Las Vegas casinos, and was once again making millions. But Meyer was still safe from arrest. Since the bugs were unauthorized, the feds couldn't use the evidence against the mob tycoon. The FBI had to watch as Lansky went about his daily life, strolling through Miami Beach, having coffee in the afternoon, and going to clubs at night. One act he saw over and over was Jewish comedian Jackie Mason, who came frequently to Miami to perform. I couldn't get over that this top man from the whole mafia is following me around. I knew he wasn't trying to kill me, so I figured he must be enjoying my act. After shows, Mason would join Lansky and his friends at their table. He loved the power. I could see he loved the power, because when people sat around him with that worshipful look on their faces, you could tell that he knew he was the boss, and he acted it. I used to say to him, how much money do you really have? I, I, I'm sweating by my life, I'll keep my mouth shut. And he would laugh and change the subject, or give me a hug, or give me a kibitz, and uh, I could never find out anything.